when The Walking Dead Season 10 comes out in October, something that still baffles me to this day, and something I didn't even really realize until I was on The Walking Dead subreddit, that Carol has not yet met Negan. Still, still, Negan's been around for three seasons, seven, eight, nine, and going to be season 10, and Carol has not had one interaction with Negan. Now, is that not crazy or what? I mean, my gosh, one of the most powerful villains this show has ever seen and one of the most powerful heroes this show has ever seen has still yet to meet face-to-face, at least on screen. And I think this is going to be a pivotal part in season 10. I think Carol is out for revenge against the Whispers. Obviously, she should be. She has every right to be correct. Negan is on a redemption path with helping Judith and the community and so forth. I think it'd be awesome if Carol just goes to Negan and she's just like, hey, I don't trust you. I don't like you, but I know you can get stuff done and I need you to come with me. But if you try something, I will kill you without hesitation. Kind of something like when she would threaten Merle or someone else in another community. Just like, don't cross me or I will kill you. But you can be an asset to me if I need you. Something like that would be classic Carol. Negan can show that he can be trusted more. And obviously, it'd be really cool to kind of see our, our former worst villain meet up with one of our favorite heroes. And of course, with the Negan redemption arc and Carol being a, a complete badass again. It'd be really cool to see them kind of work together because Negan is going to get out this next season. He has to in one way or another. And I think he's going to help our group. And it'd be interesting to see kind of the Daryl, Carol, Negan dynamic because obviously Daryl is not going to like Negan. And then Carol, I don't think is really going to care. Obviously she cares for Daryl, but if Negan can be an asset to them moving forward, she's going to use them up and that's just going to be, it is what it is. Carol is in it to win. And It's simple as that, in my opinion, and Carol will use people as she sees fit because obviously she's a survivor at this point, and she knows what needs to be done. She's been around the block a few times, and for someone like Negan, she doesn't care if he dies at all, but if he can help her take out the whispers, all the better. He's a better asset, and that's pretty much end of story. So let me know your thoughts down below in the comments. Are you surprised that There's been three seasons with Negan in it and Carol, and Carol has yet to meet Negan. I still find that very fascinating that one of our best villains in the show has still yet to meet one of our best heroes in the show. It's quite odd. But I read this on the subreddit too that it's kind of difficult to have a character like Carol meet a person like Negan, especially when they're at work, because Carol would have just probably shot him in the face. No questions asked. So it's probably best to keep those characters away at that point for storytelling because, like I said, Carol probably would have just saw him and just shot him and that just would have been that. And it just would have been, oh, okay, story is over, huh? So storytelling-wise, I get why they did that, but it's still very interesting in my opinion. I cannot wait to see badass Carol go talk to Negan and Negan, of course, make some smart-ass remark and, you know, be Negan and see Carol, Negan, and Daryl, and whoever else gets thrown in that mix, go take on the Whispers. This can be really interesting. This can be a different dynamic, that is for sure, here in The Walking Dead Season 10. So, like I said, leave your thoughts down below. I want to thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.